your grandpa named Pop, right? He died when I was your age. I saw him in heaven. Your son had a near-death experience. Do you take it as a literal event? Well, for him, it's not imaginary. It's not a metaphor or a feeling. It happened. Because heaven is probably one of the most relevant topics of all people, Christian and non-Christian. When anybody dies, they always think about going to heaven. And so this movie has incredible relevance uh, for not only believers, but for non-believers, uh, because they're all wondering what's going to happen when they die. So I can't encourage believers enough to invite their non-Christian friends to go to this movie because we need to understand the reality of heaven and the afterlife, not from a mythical perspective, but from a very biblical perspective. You saw heaven? Mm-hmm. What does it look like? Like here, but even more beautiful. And you saw Jesus? He's very nice. I sat on his lap. He has markers. Markers? Yeah. Right here, and right here, and right here, and right here. Okay, go swing on the swing some more. Yeah. So excited about this movie. I'm so excited about how it's going to impact people's hearts and their anticipation of being with the Lord one day. You. I always figured it was Jay leaving. Flags and flowers here on my son's grave. I failed you, Nancy. The worst moment of your life. Loss beyond comprehension, and I had... I had nothing for you. How you doing? I'm Miles McPherson, Senior Pastor of the Rock Church in San Diego. And not only do I believe that heaven is real, I believe that heaven is real. The movie is something every church should support. I want to encourage you, senior pastors and church leaders, to participate by buying tickets, uh, having a movie event at your church before you go watch the movie. And also, you can also buy the entire screen and fill it with your church. I can't encourage you enough to get the believers out and watch this movie so we can be encouraged about the reality and the inevitability of heaven.